Hello, Power Fam. Today we'll be learning about expanding brackets and simplifying expressions. We have our first expression here, 3 and in bracket 2b plus 5. Now we cannot plus 2b and 5 together because we don't know the value of b. So we are going to multiply. What is outside the bracket with inside the bracket so 3 multiplied by 2b and we get 6b so how we got 6b so imagine we have two b's and we multiply it three times so we've got 6b's now 3 multiplied by 5 that should be easy which is 15 now do not forget the operator in the middle so we have plus notice that it is the same operator which was inside the bracket now try to solve this yourself but before you solve it make sure that you pay attention to the numbers see if they are positive or negative numbers pause the video and solve it okay so same thing a multiplied by a and a multiplied by 3 so we just multiply what is outside the bracket by what is inside the bracket so we we have a multiplied by a minus a multiplied by 3 so we can't write it like that we have to simplify it and so a multiplied by a will become a square and a multiplied by 3 Will become 3x as you can see we have the same operator here now you should see the difference when we multiply a variable by itself and when we multiply a variable by a number so as you can see it is written in different ways Let's move on to our next question. So we have to expand this and then simplify it. Draw arrows as it helps you. So 4 multiplied by 2x, we get 8x and we plus it. 4 multiplied by 3x squared, we get 12x squared. x multiplied by 6, 6x. Now Take note that this is a negative number multiplied by multiplying by a positive number. So the outcome is going to be negative. So to simplify it, we have to collect our like terms or what I like to call friends. Now 8x and 6x are like terms. You can see the similarities between them. And 12x square and x square are like terms, they are friends. So let us gather the like terms together and on each side. So 8x and negative 6x. So 8x plus negative 6x we get 2x now how we got that let me use an analogy so imagine something is positive a positive and you give them or add negativeness by 6 so their positiveness is going to decrease and you get 2x now let us move on to the other like terms collect them positive 12x square and negative x square so 12x square minus x square now if you have watched this of my video I'll give the link up here you'll know that behind this variable there's a 
hidden one. So you have 12x squared and you took away 1x squared, so you are left with 11x squared. Now what is going to be the operator here? So we know that 11x squared is a positive number, so plus. Hope this video was helpful. Do check out some questions that I've written in the comment section below and watch more of our videos here. Also, don't forget to subscribe and like this video.